Hello traders, this is Fawad Razak Zala, Market Analyst for City Index. Today is the 25th of September 2023. So not a lot has changed from last week with bond yields continuing to rise. Uh, today the German bond yields broke out to a new 2023 high. We're looking at the US 10-year yields breaking higher again, reaching that 4.5% uh, level that uh, it had last week before coming down a little bit. So yields are again on the rise, and this is not good news for stock markets. The German DAX index, as you can see here, has broken down below this key support level at around 15,500, which we had been highlighting in recent days. So the key question now is, does it want to stay below this level or reclaim it and go higher? Judging by uh, what we've seen in recent weeks, it looks like the path of least resistance is to the downside and the sellers are in more control of price action than the buyers, I wouldn't be surprised if this were to continue heading lower. It's also worth keeping an eye on US indices. So here we have the NASDAQ 100, which closed right at support last week uh, at around the shaded blue area. Uh, with the uh, bullish trend line already broken down, it looks like the part of least resistance is to the downside. So a, a decisive move below this support zone could pave the way for a more significant drop as more and more buyers rush for the exits. In terms of the currency markets, well, the uh, dollar index did close higher for the 10th consecutive week last time. This is the weekly chart, by the way. Um, so this is uh, bad news for things like the euro dollar, the pound dollar. Uh, looking at the euro dollar, uh, well, today we had uh, further weakness in German data. The German IFO index came in weaker than expected, and this is keeping the pressure on the euro dollar. Last week, uh, the euro dollar broke below the May low at 106.35. Um, it has stopped below that level a couple of times before bouncing, but uh, we haven't seen any uh, significant move higher from it, meaning that the downward pressure is still very strong and that we could head further lower. For more market insights, make sure to check out the news and analysis section of cityindex.com. Happy trading.